In today's video, I am going to be breaking down Davion Mitchell and how he is such a great defender when it comes to basketball. He is a ridiculously fast player, so let's get down and let's check him out. Okay, so first off, what sets him apart? It's his foot speed and his ability to stop quickly. Check this out. So he's staying with his defender and then he's able to stop one, two, so that he can stay with his defender. You don't want to go stutter, 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 step. You want to go just one, two, stop, go back. And that's what we see here. Then we see a nice hesitation crossover by Book Knight through the legs and then attacks that side once again. Something else that I really want to show you is he's actually playing Book Knight straight up. He's not forcing him left or right. He's not giving him a top foot to attack. This will allow you to be a quicker defender, but also keeps your opponent guessing which side he should really attack and which side may be the better side to attack. This is called defending straight up, and it's absolutely amazing. If you're looking to be a great defender, this is what you need to do. But you can only do that if you have fast feet. Here we actually see him trying not to cross his feet. And when he does cross his feet here to catch up, his shoulders are still squared up, directing that player exactly where to go. This is what you call a very good defender. He's able to then keep his feet from crossing. Even though he crossed his feet here once, he's running with the player but keeping his shoulders with the player. This way you can stay with the player even if he does stop on a dime to try and change directions. You're able to stop at the same time as Book Knight in this case, and then he's able to stay with him taking small steps so that now, no matter where Book Knight was going to go, right or left, we would see Davion Mitchell staying with him. And then, on top of it all, Davion Mitchell is swiping at that ball. He keeps his hand up because, of course, that's a passing lane. He can then swipe down to get that ball. Of course, he's keeping his hand up in this case because, of course, Book Knight may be taking that three. He's known for taking that three. Normally, you would want to have your hand down with your palms face up. However, because... Book Knight is such a dangerous shooter, you want to keep your hand up to at least contest that shot. And then when you swipe down, make sure to hit that ball. Don't go for the arms, go for that ball. And that's what we see here. He's able to then keep his hands up, stay very tight. Book Knight then tries to draw the foul, but he's already dropped the ball anyways. He's just trying to draw a foul, and it didn't work for him. So now we see Davian Mitchell again. With great defense, we have a screener coming to try and set a screen and roll up for Davian Mitchell. However, Mitchell is able to hop through that screen. This is why, this is a mistake actually by Book Knight. So we see here Book Knight looking at the screen, looking at the screen coming. He knows. Obviously his man is also calling the screen as well, if he's a good defender as well. Which means that... Obviously, Davian Mitchell knows what's coming. Now, what does Davian Mitchell do? He then tries to cut that off. What you need to do as the offensive player in this case is to do a killer crossover or at least move this player towards that left side so that your screener can actually set up a good screen. Without that misdirection left, that allows Davian Mitchell to jump through that screen and cut off the ability for that screen to even work. This is a very high level defensive move that is just showing how good he really is. And, of course, Book Knight shows that he needs to, of course, improve his ability to use the screen and roll. So, again, we see Book Knight trying to attack the middle, but we see that Davion Mitchell has the fast lateral speed to stay with Book Knight and then disrupts that play. If you're trying to become quick like this, you know those shuttle drills that coaches usually get you to do between the key same thing just make it a bit wider because of course you're not usually just moving that distance you're usually moving from here to about here as we see in this play or you may be moving from the wing to the point or wing to corner do the same distance you would do in game but this is extremely fast of course However, something else as well, he takes one step as a run so that he can stay with that player, kicks that left leg back around so that he can continue with that defensive slide. See this? Watch. Takes one nice side step and then 
one run step and then goes back to of course the shuffle that is how you keep up with a very fast player and this is exactly what you should be doing between those pylons you should do one defensive slide one run and then one defensive slide and that's it this is really good team defense but at the same time this is really good screen and roll defense by Davion Mitchell the reason is is because Davion Mitchell knows that screens coming and gets stuck on it this man hedges out to stop that forward progression and then Davion Mitchell's going underneath the screen keeping contact with that player to stop him from running through Davion Mitchell and you yourself as a defender who gets stuck on a screen go underneath the screen there's no sense trying to go over if you're going to get stuck go underneath and stop that player from attacking the rim obviously we had great help side defense coming out as well which is absolutely fantastic for that player kudos to you whoever you are i can't tell who you are in this clip but fantastic team defense davion mitchell's able to get back to his man this man needs to get back to his man which is what we do see of course the screener tries to screen again but davion mitchell's too smart he jumps through that screen and then of course he's still with that man and now that clock is running down and we see essentially a dead play nothing happens at this point and of course goes back to nothing two seconds one second and a terrible shot on his side this should have never happened if i was in the position coming off of that secondary screen and i still would have had that player i would have done a quick crossover back fast my legs in this case his legs are already split crossover back quick forget about the screen or use them if you can maybe maybe called a moving screen but at least it's better than at least getting stuck way back here chucking up a shot and hoping for the basketball gods to love you i also want to show you this chasing defense not going for any fakes at all staying on his toes staying low staying balanced knees over or shoulders over knees over toes absolutely fantastic staying with the man cutting off his forward progression this is exactly what you want to see you want to see your ability to see what's going to happen he lifts that foot he's going this way that means that you need to take a quick step and cut off that drive stop him from moving in that direction again you see a screen coming this is another mistake this should have been another quick fake towards this side, but instead, we see that player still using that screen without using a fake, which then allows Book Knight, or I mean, Dav Davian Mitchell to get through and double team along the baseline. This is the worst spot to get stuck in, because now, you're not going to have anywhere to pass to. Great team defense, by the way, because this was absolutely fantastic. So that's Davian Mitchell and his defense. You can also play defense just like this. Really work on your lateral speed. Work on your ability to take one shuffle step, one run step, and go back to a shuffle. This is extremely important. Everyone needs to work on this. If you're looking to make an impact on your team, or if you're looking to make it to the next level, you need to play defense. You need to know how to play defense. It's going to become a bigger and bigger part of the NBA. I hope that this video has helped you as a basketball player. If it has, hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys again next time.